Yeah, hey guys, before you continue with that video, you are welcome to my channel and do not forget to hit the red subscribe button below and turn on your notification bell and comment your opinion on what you feel about this video, guys. So finally, Liquor Rose finally gets what she has been looking for, where Emmanuel is. So I know that Emmanuel too is very, very happy. And yesterday, the both of them really showed that their love is real. Yes, that they want this from themselves. I don't know what is burning inside them, but whatever that is burning inside, I pray is real, not something that someone will regret later. Because I found out that most of these housemates, when they leave the house, go and see someone's background, someone's uh, realness, they begin to say, um, this person used me this person i regret my actions i just pray it's not going to be what i think so but i wish them well uh, that's actually their business but what is my business is to keep my people updated so liquor rose emmanuel and um okay fine guys. before i continue with this liquor rose and emmanuel i have this conversation guys to really discuss with you I'm not in a relationship. I'm good, good. you should just use that one and take sometimes if girls want to make themselves why is perry and saga really discussing about nini's boyfriend i want to know about it i really want to understand is it that perry and saga are in love with nini and scared that nini have a serious date according to they said that nini said that just to scare them away i don't know why i don't really understand what they want but she's associating with everyone yes nini is relating with everyone and uh saga massaged that the other day and she was cool with, with that and i don't know if you want someone you go for the person and stop saying that she lied uh, are you there to know that she really lied she told you that she have a boyfriend a serious boyfriend okay if it's to scare you away it means that you're already trying to deal with her in that house yes i but i just feel that ibuka is going to talk about this this gossip that perry and saga is bringing up or actually brought up yes and that happened after their uh, after their jacuzzi party and now i don't know whether they did discussion with a very highness and uh they say maybe when they when they will be asked they'll say oh i was high or something i don't know but they we are just discussing it like a serious gist is it your business if you want her you go and anything she tells you take it so i am really surprised not before i was thinking that perry won't have any eyes because the other day perry was telling um oh, maria that i'm fucking damn handsome the other day he was telling his dad and i was feeling that he, he that would make him not to go for any person in that house though he never accepted the fact that he had a girlfriend or even a wife but looking at those men all of them are old men i'm very sure that i have one or two girlfriends outside the house before this baby niger and i'm very sure that most of them have they say fiance yes they are even meant to be married because look at boomer old look at uh perry old uh, all old man earrings old or old looking people and i don't know why all of them just come in see the person that is even saying is married he needs like the youngest in that house looking at his facial appearance but that is their business if they accept the fact that they do not have a girlfriend they do not have a fiance they do not have a wife who then why saying that someone that accepted that he has uh okay that she has one is a liar or because you want to probably you want to destroy her in that big brother and fly away continue with your flights and because if you are not engaged you not you do not have a girlfriend you are not even planning getting married anytime soon it means you are a flat yes i'm talking of the mostly the guys there it means you are a flat you don't come saying that someone is lying or because you feel the you, the, the boyfriend thing she said is blocking your way i'm wrong nothing is blocking your way go try your luck if she gives you the insult you take it with your full chest man Whew. let's still watch out if nini is really going to go down for anyone in that house 
I just don't know, but I pray she doesn't because it's obvious that they're already gossiping and saying ill things about her. And it's just from this saga person that she already likes. Yes, but maybe they have seen one or two reasons to say that Nini pretended to have a boyfriend, that she said it because she wanted to avoid them. Maybe they have seen the reason. I don't know, but whichever way you see it, the show is still on. Mm -hmm. The show is on. The battle line have been drawn. So let's just see who gets evicted soonest and uh, the people that remain. And of course, we know the people that people are keep, you know, actually seeing and keeping very high in that house. But we'll keep watching. Everything can happen. Nothing can, in fact, nothing can really be too sure in Big Brother's house. Nothing. The last year we were thinking praise will stay to the end, even his activeness. Oh, but let's just see how it goes, guys. So I just want you guys to please keep your, yourself stick to this, my channel, guys. And don't forget. If you have any update that you are looking for, just check my next video because that is where you're going to get it. Or you check my previous videos, guys. And always stick to my channel. Always watch my videos to the end. And always comment, like whenever you see what, uh, whenever I post, guys. You like my video. You comment on my video. You love my video, if possible. <laughs> Guys, so many things happen in Biggie's house. So back to Liquor Rose and Emmanuel. So you see, these two from that very first day, Liquor Rose entered the house. Emmanuel approached her and said, What are you doing in this house? And Liquor Rose quickly asked him the same question. From that moment, I just knew that these two persons have something in common. These two persons actually, if they don't have, they will have something in common. Yes. But is beginning to manifest step by step but we'll still see it the biggest show is still on we'll see it by the end of the show yes and again i pray none of them regrets the action because it's always like ah oh, i regret doing this i regret doing that i just really don't regret the action when this show is over they should just make sure that anything they're doing is with their clear eyes so they don't end up regretting it. That is my own advice to them. So guys, thank you very much for watching and please stick to my channel. And don't forget to hit the red subscribe button below and turn on your notification bell. And comment your opinion on what you feel about this video, guys. Love you. Stay tuned. Please don't forget to follow me on my social media handles at Jolly Choco. And I still remain your humble Jolly Choco, your musician. And I'll be dropping my song here yeah, very soon. Please do well to stream, watch whenever you see it. Turn on your notification bell, guys. And comment your opinion on what you feel about this video and every of my videos. Thank you. Check the next video, guys. Thank you.